Here is your station. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, so if you've read and understood considering it considering it clinical examination station, please begin. Okay. Hello, I am Dr. Ahmed Awad, one of the surgical doctors. Can I confirm your name and age, please? Yes, I'm Tom, 67 years old. Uh, nice to meet you, Mr. Tom. Uh, today I have been asked to examine uh, your lump and your groin. Uh, okay. That include uh, take a close look and feeling and do some special test. Are you okay with this? Yes. Uh, okay, Mister. Uh, can you tell me if there is any pain in, uh, right now? No. Okay. Uh, uh, I will be gentle with you. If there is any pain during examination, just tell me. I will be gentle with you. Okay. Yes, and I'll stop immediately. Yes. Uh, okay. okay. I. Will... I want a uh, chevron. All right. Okay. Provided. Uh, yeah, and I want to uh, exposure from uh, the umbilicus downward, and he can cover his uh, dignity. Yes, private. Uh, and I will, yeah, I will examine him after that uh, of his private part. Yes. Okay. Uh, after uh, after uh, after that, I will ask the patient to stand up yes. and to uh, to inspect the lump. Uh, yes. If it is uh, visible, uh, I will comment about the site uh, and size and uh, the the. Uh, for example, if it's a right inguinal hernia, okay. uh, it, there is a swelling uh, right side of the his groin uh, from. Uh, Extended uh, from up downward uh, to the scrotum. Uh, the swelling is uh, five by five centimeter with uh, normal skin. Uh, no uh, discharge, no visible scar, no pulsa no pulsation. Uh, also, by uh, the other area, I will inspect it for scar for discharge or other swelling. Also, I will ask the patient to cough. Please, can you cough? <coughs> yes. Okay, I will see the uh, expansile uh, uh, embolus and cuff, visible uh, embolus uh, and cuff, and uh, then uh, I will uh, ask the patient if he can reduce the swelling. Can you reduce it uh, for now? Um, it I can if I have to I have to lie down. Okay, lie, lying down and show me how you will reduce it. I will see the direction of the uh, reduction of, this, uh, of, the, okay. of the hernia. Yes. Then uh, after that, I will ask him to stand again. Uh, okay. Then I will do the palpation of the, uh, of the uh, swelling. Uh, it's yes. uh, dewy in uh, sensation with uh, mm -hmm. No tenderness, not uh, no no abnormal temperature around the swelling. Also, I will uh, palpate the testis. Uh, uh, it is uh, posterior to the swelling. Uh, also, I will uh, do the scrotal neck test. Uh, is uh, not empty, full means uh, it is an iguanous scrotal. Also, I will uh, try to uh, separate the swelling from the testis. It is separable. Okay. Yes. Also, I will, uh, after examination of this uh, mass, I will uh, palpate the, the uh, hernial orifices, uh, baraumbilical, and uh, also the superficial and deep inguinal ring. Okay. Uh, and will, uh, I comment about the size of the defect. Okay. And the size bilaterally, right and left. Uh, then I will. Uh, 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 do uh, uh, the direct uh, re, uh, uh, direct uh, direct ring uh, direct 
ring ring test i will ask the patient to reduce the swelling then i will put my uh, <clears throat> my hand over the deep ring yes uh, then i will ask him to stand again and cough if there is no uh, no swelling passing uh, down to the scrot means it is a positive it means it's okay. inguinal scrotal not scrotal yes uh, also i will do uh, Auscultate the the swelling. It is maybe if it is uh, intestinal content. Maybe I will hear the intestinal sound. Also, I will do elimination elimination test. Usually, it is uh, negative, except if it is hydrocele. Uh, also, uh, after that, maybe I will. Uh, uh, after that, I will uh, do a general uh, inspection and palpation for his abdomen. Uh, also, if uh, I have a time How would to... you determine uh, the position uh, with regard to inguinal hernia, uh, inguinal ligament? In, in inguinal ligament, I will uh, do figure four for his leg, leg and ask the patient to do adduction of his uh, uh, thigh. Yes. And I will beat the uh, pubic, uh, pubis, uh, the symphysis of pubis. Pubic tubercle, uh, okay. Uh, pubic tubercle. Uh, the swelling is from... Upward medial means it's in a guinea scrotal not femoral hernia. Okay, all right, good. Uh, Can you please uh, summarize your examination if you are done? Okay, today I have uh, been uh, examined. This gentleman uh, presented with right in a uh, right uh, in a guinea scrotal hernia. Yes. By inspection, uh, there is a, a swelling in the right uh, in a guinea, uh, right groin. The swelling is five by five centimeter. No, uh, no obvious uh, scar. No discharge. No redness. Uh, not pulsatile, uh, except it's pulsatile with uh on cuff. Uh, also, the swelling is reducible with the patient himself without pain. Uh, also by inspection, there is no other uh, hernia or hernia uh, other than this right side. Also. Yes. I will comment about uh, the uh, the palpation. It is uh, expansile implants on cuff, not tender, no no weakness. <clears throat> also, uh, I will uh, do it do in sensation. Also, yes. direct uh, deep inguinal hernia test is is uh, negative. Yes. Also, scrotal uh, neck test is uh, positive for uh, inguinal is full. Yes. Uh, also, the auscultation uh, showing gurgling uh, sensation. Yes. Uh, and uh, transelimination test. Transelimination negative. Good. My tube differential in, uh, is in igui, right in iguanus scrotal hernia. Very good. The other, yes. Yeah. What are the other common differentials that you will keep in your mind? Hydrocele, varicocele, and uh, testicular tumor, and uh, insisted uh, cyst of the spermatic cord. Yes. Yes. Lymph nodes. Yes. Lymph nodes could be. Could be yeah. Yeah. All right, please. Um, okay, even the lipoma of the cord could be there. Uh, yeah, right. Please tell me what management or treatment can you suggest this gentleman? The suggestion, uh, uh, surgical repair. Okay. For uh, this uh, uh, hernia. All right. It's just two months old. Right, and 67 yeah. years old. So is it the uh, surgical management right away you'll suggest? Uh, I, I, first, I, I will uh, treat the cause, if there is a cause for this uh, problem, like a chronic cause, cough yes. or yes. constipation, <laughs> I should treat this uh, problem. Then if it's asymptomatic, I will do a repair for his uh, groin. Okay. Right. Uh, how? All right. You have illuminated, and if it would have been hydrocele, how would have uh, patient presented? Hydrocele. Uh, it is uh, by uh, by uh, inspection. It is a scrotal uh, swelling, not any guinea scrotal. Also, direct uh, deep ring is negative. Also, the scrotal neck negative. Also, uh, the swelling is uh, anterior to the. It is uh, in close to the testis itself. Yes. Illumination is uh, positive, a clear so fluid. Showing there clear is fluid. accumulation of the fluid in yeah, and, uh, 
accumulation of the vaginal uh, Cunica vaginalis. Cunica vaginalis. Yes. yes. All right, good. And if you'll go for the surgical management, would you suggest for this gentleman with mesh or without mesh repair? Uh, it is a surgical preference, surgeon preference. It can be direct uh, repair or mesh repair. Yes. Uh, mesh repair well, is less recurrence rate, but higher yes. infection rate. Infection rate, yes. But then infection rate is surgeons dependent as well. Yeah. Good. Thank you.